Hi, water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Welcome to my main channel, Chelsea Love Tarot. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I really appreciate all of your love and support. In this reading, we are going to find out what's coming up for you within 24 hours. Today is the 2nd of October, 2023. Time here in Da Nang, Vietnam. Is 7.21 a.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. And if this video finds you, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. What's coming up for them within 24 hours? Page of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so. Ooh, okay. Huh. The lovers can indicate a choice. Two swords indicates a choice as well. So, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Some of you within 24 hours, either you're going to make a choice between two people or two. It could be anything, okay? Uh, basically, you have two options. For a lot of you, this could be related to love romantic situation because we've got the lovers right here right so you have to make a choice between two people um some of you it could just be whether you should you want to talk to this person or not anymore okay um that's just for some of you and then we've got the not a swords and lovers King of Wands and Lovers, Two of Swords, <laughs> King of Swords and Lovers, Seven of Swords. Let's start in reverse. I feel like water signs, you're going to be sitting on a fence about, again, a choice that you're going to have to be making within 24 hours or a little bit longer than that. Um, because I feel like you need to figure out if this is what you want. The star here, it's like, I'm not sure which one is the one that I really, really feel like this is it. Right? The star is like something that you wish for, something that could be, you know, we always wish for something that, I'm not saying all of us feel this way, but I don't know, I'm gonna speak for myself, okay? So the star remembers. Most times, I will feel like I want to, like I wish for something that could be out of reach sometimes, but it could also happen, right? Um, to a lot of people, maybe it's out of reach. To myself also, it may be out of reach. So it's like that kind of wish that I feel, it could be unrealistic for some people. Could be unrealistic, yeah, it could be unrealistic to yourself or to some other people so but what i'm picking up on here is that pisces cancer and scorpio it's like some of you could be wishing for you might have to make a choice between two things but you're not sure if these either one of these two things fits everything that you want right which i feel that spirits could be saying sometimes 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 maybe we are a little bit too unrealistic so it makes it hard for you to make a choice i don't know why i keep picking up on that energy where sometimes our expectations are too high or are too unrealistic because the star is really unrealistic sometimes okay huh. you may have to make a choice with the knight of cups that means something that basically is genuine okay sincerity something that's sincere something that's genuine or 
picking the person some of you're going to be feeling like should i choose from my heart or should i choose from just my desire and my passion right hmm. this is so interesting water signs and the king of swords in one verse so you're gonna be feeling like oh i'm unclear i don't know what i should do two of swords yeah i don't know which action to take what to choose and then the seven of swords here you could also be trying to run away from making a choice right There is a tendency of you just like, I don't want to deal with this right now. I don't want to make a choice right now. Um, I just want to just kind of escape from this temporarily until I can figure out, until I figure out what I want, right? But it could also be vice versa, water signs. It could be somebody else, okay? Somebody else whom could be thinking about you making a choice between you and something else someone else okay now the three of cups here is a lovers so three is a crowd so that means eventually either you or somebody will have to make a decision because it's almost like again three is a crowd it's too many Somebody has to make a choice. You or somebody who could be thinking about you right now, connected to you. I've got four pentacles and one first. Justice. High priestess and one first. Seven of wands and one first. See, nine of swords. What a science. If this is not you, this is somebody else, okay? Whom is in your energy field um, related to you. Nine of Swords, this person will be thinking heavily about you um, or you are going to be thinking heavily about this person because justice is right here. You're going to have to make a very important decision. Again, a choice, right? Should I follow my heart or should I choose that thing that I desire more? It's like choosing... <laughs> How, how do I put this? It's like choosing between like an apple and an orange. Okay, apple and an orange. Both are fruits, but both are like different type of fruits, right? Orange is citrus and apple is, what is apple? <laughs> but it's different, okay? Apple is crunchy, so leave me in the comment box below if you know what I'm talking about. So we've got these six of cups right here. There's a sense of I really wanna I really wanna revisit this connection, but I'm not sure if I can open up yet for Pentacles and one first. Um because right next to it is a seven of swords. Hmm. What a sign some of you could also be somebody from your past writing to you, you know. You might hear from somebody writing to you, reaching out to you. Maybe this person is your childhood friend or could be an ex, could be a child, okay? <laughs> could be your own child, your own children, if you have your own child children. Um, but you're going to be hearing from someone you know, okay? Someone you know within 24 hours. Um, you also could be hearing from someone where they may open up to you in regards of what's going on with them in their life where i think perhaps they aren't doing too well yeah you may be hearing from someone where this person might tell you their problems okay but it could also be someone writing you reaching out to you telling you that they miss you or wanting to apologize but definitely hearing from someone within 24 hours that you know okay and I feel like, again, this person, or it could be you if you're not feeling well, somebody may reach out to you and ask you how you are, just to check in on you. Unless it's this person who is going to write you and say that they're not doing well and they need your advice. Okay. They need somebody to talk to. 
and the seven of wands here in one first the high priestess in one first right here yeah there's some open communication someone it may spill their secrets to you or you might end up spilling your secrets to someone if you're the one fe feeling unwell i do see you reaching out to someone where you could be asking for some advice if not is somebody asking you for some advice um, because uh, again the star in reverse makes me feel like this person is not in a good place this person could be a fire sign aries sagittarius leo libra pisces cancer scorpio aquarius gemini um can be any sign okay so i see somebody just being super open to you because they trust you they trust your judgment they need your advice they need your help to tell them what to do or it could be you opening up completely to somebody because you need their advice because you don't know what to do with the two swords right here nine of swords could be you thinking analyzing about the whole situation um hmm all right what are signs pisces cancer and scorpio this is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below feel free to subscribe to my other channel it's called chelsea vlogs it's my travel channel and for those of you who like to be notified every time when i go live and every time when i post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button take care i hope to see you back here again sooner than later bye